First on four, the legal fight over the historic La Lomita Chapel continued today against the federal government. It's a fight beginning in October when the Diocese of Brownsville refused to let the government survey their land. CBS 4's Clara Benitez is live in our Far McAllen newsroom with more details on today's ruling. Clara. Chris, a judge ruled in favor of the federal government to survey the land for the construction of the border wall. According to the diocese attorney, the surveying could take one week or even six months. Rachel Welver, a La Lomita frequent visitor, holds tight her rosary. So I come here just to say my rosary outside because, you know, watching the sunset is beautiful and uh, just to meditate or sometimes I'll bring the dog. Welliver has also been attending mass every Friday for the last eight Fridays here at La Lomita. Say La Lomita, I think basically. As part of Father Roy Snipes' novena. This will be the ninth Friday, this coming Friday. Mm. But now all the folks are t saying, let's start a new novena as soon as this one's over. Because our, our worries are not over, our problems are not over, so we probably will. On Wednesday, a judge ruled in favor of the federal government, allowing them to survey the property for the border wall. The Diocese of Brownsville attorney David Garza says the lawsuit was not to take the property, just to survey it. But that would be the next step. If they decide that they want to proceed forward and take the land, then they would have a specific dimensions of the land that they want to take, and they would have to send a, an offer to, to take the land, and then at that time, if we refused, or the diocese refused to give them the right to take the land, then that's when they would file the new suit to actually take it. According to Garza, the federal government will have temporary possession for one year, meaning they can survey the land anytime within that year. I don't know how quickly the government would act. I mean, they could have people ready to go out there and survey it the next day, or it could be a month from now or six months from now. Father Roy says to keep La Lomita in your prayers as they continue to fight to keep the historical site sacred. According to Garza, the surveying should not take very long. They expect the government to give them a 72-hour notice before entering the property. Live in the Farm Newsroom with Complete Valley coverage, Clara Benitez, CBS4 Valley Tonight.